I'll see you late. <laughs> Hi, welcome to the crack of dawn. I'm Dawn Lombardi. I'm your hostess for this evening. And uh, with me tonight, I have Mary Sue Cavanaugh. How are you, Mary Sue? I'm great, Dawn. Isn't it great? So, um, Mary Sue actually lives next door to me. And we've been friends since I've lived here. 17 years, right? 17 yes. years. Yep. We're right next door neighbors, and a lot of times people say, let's go out, and I'm like, no, nah, not really. You know, I'm just gonna hang out with Mary Sue. Mary Sue will come to our house, I go there, or sometimes we'll just go out together, mm -hmm. find a place to go. So we are gonna paint a seascape. It's gonna be very simple. I'm gonna have, Mary Sue's gonna start with just, and you have no experience with art. I am a neophyte, Dawn. I told you, my neighbor uses 13 letter words. What's That's a neophyte? Eight letter. That's an eight letter word. What does neophyte mean? I've never heard of it in my life. It's gotta be some sort of helium based thing. No, it means I'm a beginner. That's a, a beginner. neophyte? It's, it's someone who does not have a skill. And in this case, I don't have a skill. A neophyte. a neophyte. See, I just learned a new word, neophyte. I never knew that word. So that means somebody that doesn't have a skill well, in a particular a, area. Beginning. You're a beginner. A beginner. You're a beginner. So if I have never got, gotten a horse before and someone said, you know, I could say I'm a neophyte. Yeah, oh, okay. and horse riding, yeah, I'm sure. I'm gonna use that next. Yeah. So we're gonna do a basic seascape. We're gonna get to know Mary Sue. Um, when I first moved here, um, you know, she's had a couple different jobs, so have I, and um, she's been living here for, so how long have you been in Farmington? Oh, geez, this time around, 24 years. 24 years? Yeah. So you moved here from Florida. Fancy. I did, yes. And you lived near like Sea Biscayne and all that? Yeah, I was in Miami Beach. Miami Beach. Is South that safe? Beach. Is that Actually, safe now? Uh, I think it's changed a lot. It has? Yeah. South Beach has changed a lot from when I was there. But I was it there. was fancy, right? You it had a great, fancy, yeah, she had a yes. fancy place. And you worked for? Otis Elevator. Otis Elevator. Mm -hmm. While you were in Miami? Yes. Really? Yes. Even though it's based here or it isn't? It's based here, but I was working in the field. Really? Yeah. Oh, isn't that neat? So then when you moved to Farmington, you clearly moved offices and had to move up to here from yes. Miami? Yes, I got a promotion. You got a promotion. Got a God, promotion. what kind of promotion okay. is that? I want to be with the sun. <laughs> did you love the sun and the beach and I all did. of it? I loved it. I loved it. I loved oh, it. God, it makes me so jealous. Everybody wants to go to the warmer weather. Oh, for yeah. sure, for sure. Yeah, I was right on the water, too. Oh, my and God. And I moved to cold Connecticut. I know, it's freezing. So we've lived, so Otis Elevator, you worked for for how long? We're going to make a line. I'm going to go fast. She's going to go at her own pace. And we're going to make a really nice seascape. Feel free to go along with us. We've got white, some elizabethan crimson, some cerulean blue. There's just fancy words for blue, red, and, and white, basically. And some yellow in case we want to make it look a little orangey. So, so we'll what should I do, Don? <laughs> first thing you want to do is take some blue that you like okay. and make a line. So it's called the horizon line. Can I just do this with a pencil yeah, first? Yeah, do it with a I'm pencil first. And you're going to make a line going straight across, and that separates your sky from your, your uh, ocean or your okay. ground. Now land. I can paint this? Yeah. Okay, so I'm going to go here, and Rich has another camera sort of near mine, so we can kind of go along together. So now um, you're it's working not a for Otis. Line. No, it doesn't matter. <laughs> straight as you can make it, and you can fix it later, because this is acrylic paint. So you know when people, you know, you've traveled the world, and you've probably been to a million museums, right? Yes. 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 And. What's your favorite country you've traveled? I think my favorite country is France because is. I speak the language. Yep. And yeah. you learned that from going there or in No, I learned in school. You did? I, yeah, I majored in French. You did? In college, yes. Oh. And I studied it in high school as well. Oh, you did? Yes. So did you go over in high school first? Or no, yes, yeah, I did. Okay. And then I studied the whole year, my junior year. Really? Yeah. Spent the junior year. You're just going to use basically water, so water-based paints. A lot of people say watercolor is the same as acrylic, but you know what? It kind of is in a way, okay? It obviously comes out of a tube. Well, watercolors come out of tubes too, but it's water-based paint which means you can you you can mix water and make it spread. So you want me to just go like this? Yeah, and leave a little open right here because this okay. our, our sunlight's going to come down here, our, okay. our, our sunset. So it's going to, and these are very easy paintings. If you have a beach house of your own, like say, and you don't have anything to put on the walls, a lot of people go over to like, you know, Target or whatever, they buy that art and it's fine. And then leave the middle, uh, Leave a lot of space in the middle so that we can put some pink and stuff there. I and didn't so, leave that much space, but... Well, that's okay. And your water's going to make it spread if you want to use water. And I usually paint the sides, but you can do that later. Yeah. See, I'm kind of... 
Now, at Otis Elevator, oh yeah, it doesn't matter if some of it's dark. It looks like darker ocean, you know? So mine's so <laughs> far looking like this. Okay, you're getting the, there. You're the artist. Tom. They're gonna look good when we're done. And paint the sides, and I'll, I'll help her. I'll paint on, on my side so she doesn't have to do it. But um, paint the sides, because you don't have to worry about framing and stuff. Okay. Now, okay, so let's follow back to when I didn't know you. So you grew up um, not in Connecticut, not in Florida. No. Where'd you I grow up? I grew up um, in Chicago, but outside of Chicago. In a, like where they filmed Home Alone? Uh, yeah, well, not there, not that town. I grew up in, uh, north of there Winnetka? in Lake Forest. In that Lake was Forest? In Lake Forest, yeah. Oh, wow, that's fancy. And your mom was an interior designer, right? Yes. And that went for that area, right? Because she wanted some, probably had some high-end clients, right? Um, yeah, it was more when she was in Florida. It was? Yeah. Oh, really? But, she, but yeah, she studied a lot while we were Oh, in, she did? Oh, that's so yeah, neat. in Lake Forest and all. And, and then, then you went to Lake Forest High? I did. You did? Is I it, did. Oh, my gosh. I can't believe it. Did you go to school with a bunch of movie stars and stuff? No. No, mo no. Nobody no? famous that I'm aware really? of. Really? No. And then, did your parents work in downtown Chicago? Or did my dad they, did. He did? My dad did, yeah. He did? Yeah. He was a stockbroker. He was? Mm-hmm. So that was the perfect place to live. Yes. And then when did you, your family up and sell in law? In, uh, they, they left and moved to Florida when I was a senior, my second semester of my senior year in high was school. Was it really? Yes. And, and then I, they moved. I lived with my piano teacher for a semester. You know what? You told me that I had a blast. Once. I had a blast. She was fabulous. You lived with the piano teacher? I lived with a 70-year-old piano oh teacher. Oh, my God. And Which she would probably let you do whatever you wanted, right? She was pretty cool. She was a really cool lady. Now we're getting to like oh, here. Look at mine. Don't oh. worry, add water. Okay. Yeah, when you add water, it spreads everything. Even if it drips, it doesn't matter. Nobody cares. Oh, and then what God. we do, since we have this, and a lot of people will make strokes, you know, like little kids do, like this. Like, you know, that doesn't, that's not the way water looks, really. You know, when it's. Oh, this is much better. Okay. See, add the water. Okay. Yes. Thanks, Don. And then just leave some space, leave like that, because we can put pink over that and it'll look great. Okay, this is much better. Yeah, you add water, and it, it makes it, what's the word, a fancy word, soluble, soluble, I can't even say it, <laughs> soluble. Soluble, I yeah. learned so many, the first word you ever taught me was, um, someone was like, oh, should I have cheesecake, or should I have carrot cake, or should I have, and Mary Sue goes, God dang it, she's so ambiguous, and I was like, what's that mean? And she goes, wishy-washy, <laughs> she can't make up her mind. And I was like, oh my God, and I've always remembered that word, it's one of the only, See, I can't remember the nephronite. I'm a nephronite. I'm a neophyte. neophyte. I'm a neophyte. <laughs> See? You're not a neophyte. I'm no, a neophyte. No, uh, you're the painting. neophyte. In painting. So now, when you went over to Paris? No, I didn't study in Paris. You didn't? No, I studied in Montpellier, which is southern France, just. Um, Making some pink it's now. The west, west of the Riviera, um, just as France dips down towards Spain. I was only two hours from the Spanish border. Perfect, Rich. We used to go really? To, That's how to go, quick? We used to go to Spain for lunch. You did? Yeah. It's near it Spain? Fun. Oh, I didn't yes. know that. And then if you want your pink lighter, just add more. Oh, that. I haven't even started that. Oh, don't worry. <laughs> Keep doing the blue. Okay. And then you put some blue up here. Okay. You just leave like this part, little, you know, leave some for your sunset. But blue and red make purple. And when you add the white, it makes like a purpley pink. Have fun with these. It's like, just make sure your brush is going like straight across like this. Well, I'm trying, but it's, it's, yeah, it, it, it's it right. gets all crazy. It's going to look gorgeous. Then you'll have an original painting of your own. <laughs> the very yeah. first one. It'll be the gorgeous. Oh, yeah. So let's see. So now, fast forward to, now you're working for? Um, Learning Dynamics. Learning Dynamics. Which is a learning and development company and talent management company. We're based here in... Um, Connecticut. And How old so is the company? Pretty old, right? 40 years old. It is? Yeah. Oh, okay. We just celebrated our 40th anniversary oh, last really? year. Oh, really? And we do a lot of training for corporations, for I'm small and medium-sized companies. Okay. Boy, that looks, I'm not seeing any difference. I love this wave thing. I'm doing it. <laughs> She's got a glob of wave. Hold on. I'm going to show you it. Here's her glob of wave. I don't think you can, oh, hold on. Sorry. She's got a glob of wave. It's just a big blob of color, but it looks like a wave. So I'd leave that if I were her. <clears throat> Excuse me, and I would start with the pink. I'm gonna and, do that now. Yeah, I've got an alizarin crimson, which has a touch of blue in it, so it's not just straight red. Red and white makes an okay pink, but if you wanna add a little peach to it like a sunset, you just add a touch of yellow with that pink. 
and that'll make it a peach. So, so if you I want can some just peach in it, do a little bit of like yep. this sort of, and lots of white. See? Yeah. And you just go along. It's going to come out gorgeous. Okay. Yeah. This is kind of cool. So we were just saying. So our houses are from the 1940s, and. Um, I love our houses, actually. Don't you? I do. I mean, yeah. they're very well insulated. They're very well built. Are they 1940? Yeah, 1941. Yeah, and every single house on our street pretty much looks the same, except for the builder's house, who, which is for sale right now if you want to buy it. What is it, 360 or something? It's very affordable, the neighborhood. So, you know, a lot of times, oh, you know, live in Farmington. It's like our, our neighborhood's very affordable. It's very nice. And we have larger yards than most, most people do. About half an acre. Half an acre. Yeah. And we had most of our trees have always already fallen down, so we don't have to. We don't talk about that. We don't talk about that. We don't talk about that. Every time we have a storm. Every time we have a storm. Every time we have a storm, we worry. We call each other and say, okay. Yeah, it's awful. Awful. Because we were a tree farm, right? Our neighborhood? Yes, it was. So yeah. I have gorgeous trees on my property. I didn't take them down. And your, your house. <clears throat> The people that lived in your house are the people that were architects for the, what is it called again? The exchange. The exchange. Yeah, as a matter of fact, that's So true. a lot of doctors and uh, medical people or dentists are in that building. So if you're watching, yeah, Mary Sue, the, her house, those people lived in her house. Oh, so they did a lot of upgrades to your house. Yes. I yep. would say, yeah, Mary yes. Sue's house is upgraded. A lot of ours aren't. Mine is just getting there because we're just starting, but like hers is already done. And then a lot of us are just kind of starting. So there's not too many houses left. I would say, what about the professor? Is he still there? Do we know? I don't know. I know, right? So and then just make, make sure this you, color matches whatever you're going to put there. How did you, um, how more did you? More white. More white? Yeah. So I can do this? Yeah. Like that? Yeah. Okay. And it's easy. Even if our sunsets don't look alike, it's a nice <laughs> sunset. You can hang it in your house. I can assure you, does not look. I kind of like, like it. Sometimes it's slightly <laughs> better. The, my last guess was That's better really than mine. That's really pretty cool. <laughs> yeah, and then if you want like that orangey thing that I did, it's kind of like you can put that. You can keep moving it over here, whatever color okay. you like. You can so, add more okay. red, whatever. More water is going to make it watered down. But they're fun as long as your horizon line stays, and then your sunset's going to kind of go into the water. You know, so now like it this. Looks yellow, which is well. No, that's pretty. Okay. It's pretty. I'm going to keep going with mine. Well, and then you we know have what tons you're, of you know what you're doing. I don't. So this is okay. Yeah. For a first time. <laughs> I know, right? And so, are I'm you? I'm not getting orange. Okay, here we go. How Oops. many times and how how long did you live in France? For like a whole I, year. I spent a whole year there. You did? Yeah, my junior year. Yes. The whole year? Yes. Oh I my did. gosh, you did? I did. Did you ever come home? No. I, well, I did. I came home Christmas to graduate. Or something. I, oh, you did? No, no, no. I did not come home during the year. No. You didn't. No, God. I came home to graduate though. I that wanted was it? to stay. You I did? wanted to stay. And you yeah. were saying, you know, Mary Sue was saying, what are you watching now on like you, you know, YouTube? You're watching like you can be a virtual, you can live oh, wherever you want. Yes, a what digital nomad. A, a digital, digital nomad. nomad. That's what I wanted to be. How's that? Look at that. Look at yours. Now you got to make the, uh, it, it's going to reflect into your water, see? Okay, so now I have to Just do. bring this parlor here and you can even mix it into some of there too. It's so fun. Okay, this is kind of cool. Yeah, it's very cool. Considering. Plus it's going to look great when you're done. It might be Boy, better than mine. Glad you I'm glad we are doing something simple, Don. Yeah, I told you. We're doing something easy. This People is that really have never good. painted, it's like to grab a sunset. Just make sure your lines are going like this, you know, straight across. <clears throat> and then it'll well, look good. Well, it's a little wavy, but that's okay. No, that's okay. And then if you were wanted to, you could add a lighthouse in the background or something. We're not going to do that. We're going to leave it very simple. And as you can see, my lines are going just straight across. Was your mother good at art because she was interior decorator or no? Um, no, totally I mean she she knew how to draw very well because you know for interior she design did. she knew how she had to know how to do that. And she but, did very well. Like who was her like most famous client? Oh, she worked for the chairman of the board of Cartier. The jewelry did, person? Yes. Are you kidding? No. She did. Jesus. Um, it's yes, crazy. So. Ten minutes. I love Rich. Rich just told us ten minutes to watch this. We love Rich. <laughs> I mean, isn't it gorgeous? Rich might need a painting for his house. Hey, this is. He a, might want yours. I'm so mad. I guess like, yours no, is actually definitely better. No, it's not. So remember. She's just being nice. No, I don't know. We'll show them. It's different. You want to be different. You don't want just something being that. Just nice. Yeah, mine you could buy at Ocean State Job Lot or, you know, Target. 
Mary Sue's well, is a considering little different. This is 15 minutes worth of yep. whatever. Um, and then now with the pandemic, has it made your job easier, harder? It's definitely, when I'm home teaching, different. I kind of like it. It's but I would miss the kids. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's a little different because we do a lot of, you know, virtual training. Yeah. Um, so we had to get really good at Zoom. Yeah. And uh, WebEx and some of the other. What was the other one you were on today? I had a team. Teams, yes. Yeah. S similar or was it? Pain? It's, it's uh, a little more complex. Let's it is. It, that it is. Yes. Is that's not really reflecting? I love but it. It's pretty cool. No, it's good as long as it's similar. Oh, I colors. have a wavy horizon. I love it. Let me show you Mary <laughs> Sue's. See? I'm telling you. She's ne I mean, when's the last time you painted a picture? Have you ever gone never. and never in your never. life? Never in my life. Not those paint parties that the ladies no, go to I and never, drink wine? I've never done that. You've no. never done no. this? No, nope. I love it. We've got someone that's never painted. I mean, we're kind of opposite, though. I mean, she's, oh, so here's the thing. I was <laughs> asking Evan, Evan Goldstein. I think it was Evan. Evan's a lawyer. And I'm like, what's I'm the jealous. one thing you have to be good at to be a lawyer? And you know what he said? Reading. <laughs> So, is that how you learn all the vocabulary? Yeah, I read a lot. Lots of reading. Yes, yes. And I what do. are you reading now? Do you really want to know? Yeah. I'm reading The Maps of Meaning, The Architecture of Belief by Jordan Peterson. Oh, God, how many pages are we talking about? Oh, it's about 450 pages. Oh, it's geez. all about the evolution of thought and reasoning and how man has applied meaning to his life. And that's what you're reading now. And that's what I'm reading now. And if you don't like a book, do you ditch it and just start another one? Like yeah, within the, okay, I so do sometimes that. you do. I mean okay. I like a lot of I like a lot of fiction, but you know, I'm in the into the nonfiction right now, so that's that's fun. Oh it's nonfiction, yeah. It's that's not, like. Yes, it's definitely nonfiction. I like nonfiction better because this then is I'm way like learning too. More. I love these. These look great. Yeah, pretty soon Rich will say five minutes and they'll be done. Then you have to sign it kind of fancy, Mary. So a lot of people you know, they sign it like as big as the whole dang. Oh, is this, I got is it. that? It's not really. I don't want it to tip over on you. It's gorgeous. That's not really reflecting, though. It's kind of not reflecting. Oh, I'll show you why. So basically, all she has to do here is she has to take a little of this blue, and don't be afraid because she's got it. So this is her horizon line there, and she just needs to take a little blue so that it looks like it's still the ocean. And you can even pull some of this purple and reds down here, too. Thank you. Well, you can mix the red with the blue. It's just going to turn a purpley. And okay. you can even, like, see, I'm kind of mixed you, right all, all together. Mine does not look like a seascape. You can all do it this. looks like is a bunch of Try lines. This. Do this. <laughs> and that's OK. Do this. It's very abstract. Yes, do I this. like it. Keep going. Okay. Blend it in with the water. And I mean, we still have a ton of time left. So yeah, we're not, we're kind of thinking about, I don't know where I'd move, but I mean, you sure had it made in Miami Beach. I did, I loved it. How Miami. big was it, the, the thing? Uh, I had, you mean my condo? Yeah. It was like 1,500 square feet. It was? Mm -hmm, right on the water. Right, you could see the ocean from your? Yeah, the ocean was my horizon. It was? I lived on, on the intercoastal, so I lived on Biscayne Bay. You did? Yes, and I loved it. You did? I loved it, And yes. could you walk downstairs and just go wherever you wanted? Didn't she have like Bellman and everything like oh, that? Oh yeah. Yeah, she had oh, yeah. like Doorman and Oh yeah, it was very Alejandro. fancy. <laughs> what was his name? <laughs> <laughs> I forgot his name. Alejandro, I definitely remember him. Yeah. And then you <laughs> So did you do cooking and stuff like in there? Or did you just oh, hit yeah. the road and go down the beach oh, and No, I did. You yeah. did? Yeah, I did. Oh, I love this. Anytime it drips like even I go like this. Just fixes it quick. Yeah, well, you can it's go just, back, you can put nice in some more abstract. red. It's a nice abstract. It certainly does not look like the ocean, but I'm okay with I that. I love it. You said put more great. blue in. Yeah, add the blue. Okay. Even if it goes over those colors. Yeah. It's very hue-y. Yeah, and you can even go back and put some more blue in with the purple. <laughs> like Sea Watch, I'll do mine. See, I could go in and just add some more blue if I want. I'm not concerned. Yeah. As long as it looks pretty good and it can hang on the wall. I mean, people hang these things up all the time. I see them all the time. I saw it. This is the painting that came up on my Facebook page oh, for the shoot. Dick Blick painting of the month oh, or I something. Just, I just oh, that's nothing. Just bring it over. Sweep it over. Yeah, so it came up as the Dick Blick, you know, artist of the month. And I thought, you know, it's good, but I thought we can do that. So you can do these too, you know, at home. You can do these at home. Believe me, you can do them at home because 
I say know, your no. friend, you know, bought a new beach house or someone's, you know, anything like that. We're just going to float it in, make it look great. And it's perfect. It goes by so fast. <laughs> We've got five more minutes. And a lot of people, oh my God, five minutes. It goes by very fast. <laughs> but get a canvas. Now, two of these, they come in a double pack at Walmart. But what I do is we live next door to Dick Blick. Oh, they, it's Blick now. Blick, no Dick. No Dick, it's just Blick. And, um, you know, I was going to order a canvas online because I need one for a, a commission I'm doing. And then I thought, you know what? It's like $5 more here. And it's also local. That is gorgeous. I love it. I want that one. You want Hers has more, like, texture in it. You'll see. At the very end, we'll flip them around. We can see Rich from here when he tells us we have a minute left. We'll flip them around when we're done. Now, make a nice signature. Oh, you know what? You can draw it in with a pencil at the end because it's very hard to write your name with a big you yeah. know, brush. We got well, big I brushes. I have too many of these little white things. Blend it in with your blue. OK. Yeah. Cool. Like this, yeah. sort of? Yeah. You okay. can take more blue. Doesn't have to be the same blue we started with. See, mine isn't. And you just want it. I mean, people hang this stuff on the wall. They're paying two together. Called a diptych. I'm sure you know what that means. Two. And then I think there's a triptych, which is three, hanging together. Yep. So this okay, is the so first, you've is, never painted a painting? Never. So this was, I'm glad you- Didn't you date some artists though? You dated I did, artists, yes, yeah. I did date an artist. He was a- Was he interesting to date yeah, <laughs> artists? He, yeah, he was- he Total was, opposite brain than you, right? Uh, very much. quirky, but- Yes, um, quirky. But right. very talented. He was, he sculpted out of limestone. He did? Yes, and then he was also a painter, but he did a lot of abstract. I, I like I, his work. There's one on your shelf. It's yes, like a lady or yes. something. Yeah, and if you, I love it. I think it's great. I think. I'm going to add more to mine. Hers has better colors. So I'll show you quick. So here's mine. Okay. And should I show mine? Yeah, and then hers. Whoops. That's okay. See, so similar. Let's see, she has more colors in her. Um, yeah, see, I'm shaking mine. Hers is there. I like. I, I like, have a lot of orange in I mine. I like that. You have more pink. I'm going to, since we have probably three minutes, I'm going to make mine have some more orange because I get jealous. Not in a bad way, but, in, you know, I just do. I'm going to let it be. Yours is good. I'm going to try to make mine. If I do any more, I'm going to ruin it. So this is perfect. So I'm so glad you finally came on the show. I love having different people on. My next guest is going to be Kochi. Remember the Kochi? Yes. Yeah, so if you go to Ocean State Job Lot and you see him there, he's a huge help. He's very, um, very helpful. He's been working there forever. And we have one minute left. Oh. I'm so glad oh, you came no, on. I like your yellow. Yeah, see, I just copied her yellow. Yes, but you have straight lines. Mine's just a blur. No, but you know what? It's weather. Yours could have a little going on. And <laughs> mine is just straight lines going straight across. So oh, another this, thing. This was fun, though. I thought we had a great time. So with that, wrapping it up, I'll do this with mine. And I'll turn hers like that. And if you want to be a guest on The Crack of Dawn, please give us a call down at Nutmeg TV. I'd love to have you on. I love guests. I don't really like painting alone because we learned so much about neighbors, friends, um, learning dynamics. If you're a big business out there or something and you're looking for something, what is it, strategizing how to market and well, stuff like that? we do training and development. We do leadership training, all kinds of things. It's so, so cool. Yeah. So you have to look that up. That's what she does for work. And, uh, you know, you, you, when you were at Otis, you definitely hung out with George David. I'm right, right? Sometimes. I didn't hang sometimes, out. Sometimes. Once. I didn't hang out with him. Once. He was my boss. Once. He was, he was your boss. boss. He was my I boss. I can't even believe it. And Henry Gray. Oh, no. Henry Gray. Harry Gray. Harry Gray. Harry Gray was the chairman. He at was? ATC when I was there. So now I'm dating myself. So. Uh, and he lives on High Street. So we probably have no minutes left, but thank you for tuning in. Thanks for being my guest. Thank we had a you, great Don. time, and we'll go back home and hang out as neighbors. I enjoyed it. <laughs> I, I had you, fun, Don. too. I like yours better. Okay, bye-bye. Thanks for tuning in.
The Saybrook Fish House in Canton has been serving fresh seafood, chicken, and steak entrees for 34 years, offering three cozy dining room settings, a newly renovated pub with craft beer, wine by the glass, specialty cocktails, and a lighter fare menu. Open for lunch and dinner seven days a week. Reservations accepted for parties of 2 to 42, and gift certificates are also available. The Saybrook Fish House, nestled at the crossroads of Route 44, 202, and 179 in Canton.